Were you aware of just how biased Mr. Strzok was? No, I was not. We recognize we have employees with political opinions, and it's our responsibility to make sure those opinions <clears throat> do not influence their actions. I believe that Director Mueller understands that and that uh, he is running that office appropriately. That was the line he towed yesterday. Congressman Louis Go Gohmert and other members of the House Judiciary Committee grilled Deputy Attorney General Rod Rosenstein yesterday over possible bias in Robert Mueller's Russia probe. But did Congress get any of the answers they were looking for? Texas Congressman Louis Gohmert joins us from our nation's capital. Louis, good morning to you. Good morning, Steve. Great to see you. Uh, great to see you as well. You had a busy day yesterday. What was your headline out of the hearing? Well, just that uh, so many on the um, special task force, the special counsel's force, are, are, aren't just biased. They're oozing hatred for Trump out of every pore. And we finally got to see these texts that the IG had uncovered from right. Strzok. And it is so clear. I mean, you know, those of us that used to try lawsuits uh, in front of juries, you go through jury selection to make sure that nobody as biased as these people get anywhere near being the the justice right. for your client. And these guys were handpicked by m And I would submit humbly, the reason that they were knocked off uh, this special counsel force was not because they were biased. He had to know how biased they were and been part of the, mm -hmm. the selection process. The reason they were kicked off is because their absolute hate came out in things like these uh, right. these text messages. Sure. So as long as the public didn't know how much hatred there was on the special counsel force for the president, it was okay. But when the public found yeah. out, really hate it, but I'm going to have to let you get off because the public's found out right. how bad you you're, are. You're right about that. If uh, folks missed some of the texts, we uh, ran them yesterday. Here's one of them. Uh, Lisa Page says, God, Trump is loathsome human. Then she texted that she texted that to her boyfriend, Peter Strzok, who said, yet he may win. Good for Hillary. OMG, he's an idiot. Talking about uh, Trump. Yeah. God, Hillary should win 100 million to zero. Uh, and, Louis, I but, know... But y'all talked about it earlier, but the big one, you would talk about a headline is when they talk about an insurance policy against uh, even if Trump wins, they have to have an insurance policy. And that mean, right. can mean only one thing. They got to take him out if he does survive the election. It sounded ominous. Uh, you know, the president of the United States, uh, I know you want to know what was in that FISA warrant to get them to start exactly. everything. The president could declassify that himself right now, and we'd all know by noon. Yeah. And I, I know the president. I know he would love to do that. But people would probably freak out if the president uh, went ahead and declassified. Yeah, but if it's things. based but on I the phony dossier, people should you know bet. that. You bet they should. And so I'm sure that uh, the president's heard from some of these career uh, attorneys like yeah. Rosenstein. Oh, let's let's that. He needs to do it. He really does. Well, let's see what happens today. Uh, Louis Gohmert from Texas. Thank you all for digging into it. Thank you well, so much. Well, thank you for uh, joining us today.